The diver trainees form up according to their height, where they are split into groups of between seven to eight men. For the next 20 weeks or so, they will remain in this group, training hard together, pushing and motivating one another. And they have to learn to work together as an effective team. The main thing we here we want to instill is uh, the camaraderie, the body of uh, honor, integrity, and team spirit. Team spirit is the most important thing that will carry them a long way in the operational unit. Any instructions will go to him first, right? Class leader and the two I say, okay? You will take instruction at all times. You people better listen to what he's saying. If he f***s up, you are the cause. Trust me. As combat diver trainees, the expectations are very high. They're reminded that they're no longer recruits. The training base picks up. Hey guys, five minutes to sign your name. Make it quick. It's getting stricter and everything has to be faster. Just getting ready to get hammered. Uh. Yeah. yeah, just get ready to get hammered stuff. She's basically doing physical training until lunchtime. It's actually quite a nerve wracking experience. They're ordered to get wet and sandy, head to toe, as punishment for moving too slow. A little dazed, they head to the grinder, a place no bigger than a basketball court. Push-ups. A lot, a lot of push-ups. Be tough, uh. physically, mentally, emotionally. From now on, I do we pass out. Prepare to get hammered. Try not to think so much. Yeah. Really push them to the limit, to make them understand what is your limit. As the relentless physical exercise can be quite grueling, the men are required to hydrate every few minutes. You find yourself the fittest among the whole life will be the pump in the CDC. Okay? 
from a bit of memory, you cannot take it. Let me tell you. You can forget about your health. Okay? This is to get you up to your health. Okay? Are you okay? No. Not all can take the physical punishment. While this soldier falls out to recover, the rest know that the worst is yet to come. Anticipating for more to come and just getting mentally prepared as much as I can. Have I made myself clear? Yes, yes sir! As the first day winds down, a good hot meal among boat buddies is a nice respite from the day's fast pace start. My family and my girlfriend are pushing me forward, like encouraging me and keep me motivated so that I won't give up. I want to prove to myself that I can do it and I want to prove that I, I have what it takes. Super shake. I really want to cry with <laughs> it.